I never thought I'd have to make a video like this and I definitely didn't plan to, but as you can see by the title and thumbnail of this video, I lost everything. As you all can see behind me, both tanks are completely empty. There's no water in there and um, all the fish, everything is gone. Everything I've worked for for the last four years is completely gone. Um, I don't have any of it. All my hard work, sweat, blood and tears, you know, countless hours here, um, you know, I, I, I lost it all. Um, I feel I feel like a failure, honestly. I feel like I let a, a lot of you guys down, and I'm sorry for that. Um, I've had a really t hard time, you know, trying to come together and make this video. Um, I know I have a lot of supporters out there that kind of keep up with my videos, and if you've seen more recently on Instagram, it's kind of been some old recycled content, and um, I haven't been able to, uh, you know, show you all anything because I wanted to formally come on here and just tell you all what happened. Um, but like I said, you know, the tanks are are empty. I don't. This is probably the first time in my life that I haven't had any fish, um, you know, at least for the last four or five years, I don't have anything. And so with that being said, you know, we're kind of at ground zero right now. And I don't know what the future will be. Um, I'm just, I'm still really heartbroken, you know, like my short body red tail, my platinum paddlefish, my stingrays, all that, like it's completely gone, you know. And so that day, uh, I was basically just carrying out buckets and buckets of fish and I kind of felt like all my hard work and uh, everything had just kind of gone to nothing. You know, I lost, I lost countless um, amounts of money on these fish as well, and tens of thousands of dollars on these fish that we spent. Spent all my time and money on these fish, and you know, at the end of the day, like these fish to me, they were so they were valuable not because of what the price tag on them was or what I paid for them. They were valuable to me just their personalities and how much I get to interact with them and. Um, just do cool stuff and uh, to not have any of them anymore. It's just, it's a weird feeling. These, these fish are my pets. Like they're, they have like a personal connection, you know, a personal bond with them. So to see them just pass away and um, yeah, it was just, it was really heartbreaking for me and I've had a really hard time with it. And uh, I feel like I let everybody down. And I know a lot of people are gonna say, you know, it's just a fish chase, like, you know, it's replaceable. But to me, like, these are my pets, these are my babies. And I, you know, it's like, it's like a dog or cat to me. You know, I, I was with them for four years, almost a lot of them. I watched them grow, you know, a couple feet, even some of them, the short body red tail, especially like that was my baby, baby. Um, I would like consider that like, his, like a dog to me. And so just, just the fact that this had to go down this way, it was just, it just sucks. I, that's no other way to describe it. Um, I've been like, so sad about everything that's happened and I just feel awful for it and I wish that I was a, could have been able to prevent it um, but you know here we are now and there was nothing I could do you know I came in and everything was just it was gone and I don't know what's gonna be next for me um, I don't know if we're gonna get more fish if we're gonna fix the ponds if we're gonna take them out and try to do something differently but I never want to have a feeling like this again you know, it just goes to show how fast things can change from good to bad. I was here that night, um, all the fish looked great. They all ate, everything was perfect. And then um, I checked my cameras before I went to bed around 12 o'clock. And uh, I got to call like six or seven o'clock in the morning that day, just basically saying that there's no water left in the tank and um, everything had passed away. So I immediately ran over here and you know, when I walked in the room, like if this was at my house, it would obviously ruin my house, but um, you know, 3,000 gallons of water over the floor, uh, does a lot of damage as well as, you know, just seeing everything dead. And um, it was just, I don't, it just sucks. That's all I can really say about it. Um, and yeah, and like I said, I don't know what the future will be for me. Um, I'll be posting an updated video next week, just about, uh, you know, about the ponds, more in depth of what really happened that day. I love doing the Instagram stuff, it's super fun. I love posting content for you guys, but not having, you know, I don't have anything to post anymore. I don't, I don't know what I'm going to do. I would love to revamp the ponds, but I really spent all the money I had, you know, the first time around and I spent all my money I had on all the fish and everything like that. So it's just very discouraging to me. And, um, I'm just, I want to apologize to all you all for letting you guys down. You know, I know a lot of you all watched the videos and, uh, got to see a lot of the fish and whatnot. So I, I just, I'm sorry for that. And, um, I really hope that we can somehow find a way to bounce back and uh, never have something like this ever happen again. But I just, I really need your all support more than ever right now. This is just, it's been really hard on me and um, I just have a really bad taste in my mouth 
uh, just with fish keeping in general. And um, I just, I never imagined this would happen. And uh, I just, I thank you all for your all's constant support. So uh, thank you all for watching this video. And um, I'm sorry that I had to be kind of a downer today, but I just, I just owed it to you all to be um, honest and transparent with you all. And I thank you to all the new people that are here, as well as all the uh, OGs that have followed me, you know, since the very beginning. I just, your all support means everything to me and I really need it right now more than ever. So uh, just, if you could like this video, maybe hit the subscribe button. Uh, I would really appreciate it. And um, I hope, hope you all uh, stay tuned to watch the video next week. Thank you.